Hi beauties! How you beautiful people doing today? How you beautiful people doing today? I hope you're doing amazing. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Marina. If you're coming back, thank you. I appreciate you. I just hope you're doing amazing. Whatever's amazing to you, I hope you're doing great. On today's video, we have our baby boy. It's already six months old. Like what the freak? Is this a joke? When I had this little baby in the back of an ambulance, in the back of an ambulance, I had this little one, couldn't wait. Everybody was like, oh, oh, second babies come fast. Second babies come fast. I was like, but they're like 11 years apart. So I'm, it's like starting all over again, right? So it's not gonna be that fast. Well, it was fast. It was painful, but it was fast born with the freaking umbilical cord around his neck wasn't breathing oh my gosh it was a scary freaking day if you haven't watched my labor and delivery story you guys it's on the channel go and watch it he was born his eyes were closed the whole time for like a week straight he did not open his eyes yeah. who's up there who's that who's that he rolled over from back to stomach stomach to back that's how he moves okay he's not crawling yet that's how he moves he gets around you put him in one place you come back it's like whoa whoa whoa, whoa. what are you doing here you... oh you okay a little spit up yeah a little spit up that's okay you want your toy use your hands papa good job Yay! Good job! I'm going from his back to stomach, stomach to back. From hand to hand, he transferred objects. I don't know why I gave him that because now you guys can't hear me. <laughs> you can't speak. Look at his face. Is that funny? Exclusively breastfeeding. So I'm okay with him not having any teeth right now. He's sitting up. He can sit up for quite a long time. Here you go. Whoa. <laughs> good job. So good at that. Can I have it? No. Oh, thank you, Papa. Thank you, baby. Do you want it back? He's spitting up. He say thank you, Mama. You say thank you to mama? Same. Da da a lot. Okay. So where, are you, where are you going? Why? Why? Come here. Who is that? Who's that boy? Who's the boy? Who is it? He's rolling over with ease. He does it from his back to his stomach. He's standing back and forth. We put him down for a nap or to go down for bed. He's like going in circle in the crib, doing 360s in the crib. Whoa, whoa, who's that boy? Whoa, whoa. Oh, yeah, the papa, the papa, my baby. Nya, 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 baby. You want the camera? You want the camera? Whoa! Whoa! I did papa, I did papa, I did papa, I did papa. Make sure you are spending time with your little one, giving them all the love and the attention. I know it's hard sometimes with postpartum. It's just, it's really hard to um, be in the moment because it's just, it's just a lot. But try to enjoy it. Take some time for yourself. Take a breather if you can't. If baby's crying a lot, you know, leave them in the crib for a few minutes, 10 minutes, let them cry. Go use the bathroom, take a shower. 
as long as they're fed and clean, they're okay. You know, take care of yourself and take care of the little one. They're so much more fun when you are happy to be in the moment and enjoy them. When you are happy, when you're in the headspace, when you are fed, make sure you're eating. Make sure you're eating because you gotta be, you, gotta, you need the energy to love up to love on these little ones, to play with these little ones, right? Make sure you take care of yourself, you guys. Take care of the babies. You guys take care of yourself to take care of the babies. Right, Papa? I love you. I love you. Postpartum for me was kind of rough because, you know, my de with my delivery, I had a smooth pregnancy. Thanks to God, delivery wasn't bad. It was bumpy. But we made it through and it's now six months later and this one is so loving and cuddly and and I just can kiss him all day. I can't wait to take my makeup off so I can kiss on him, kiss on him, kiss on him. That's all I want to do all day long is kiss on you, Papa. So make sure you are taking care of yourself. If it's you're still not feeling like you're back to yourself mentally, you know, talk to your doctor, talk to somebody. If you feel like you need the help, talk to somebody. If you're breastfeeding is not going too well, talk to uh, a lactation consultant because they are really helpful. Yeah, if you know, if anything, anything can be fixed. Anything has a solution. If you got going through something, you don't know what to do. Talk to your doctor. Look it up on YouTube. Look it up on Google. You'll find some answer on there. Um, you'll find some answer. So breastfeeding is not going as smooth as, as you like it. A bunch of YouTube videos on breastfeeding. Talk to your doctor about referring you to a lactation, lactation consultant. So you can talk to, because in the beginning for me, they had to come over and because my milk wasn't coming in. In the very beginning. Right, Bubba? You couldn't get milk? <laughs> okay, it's basic. You over it, Bubba? Are you over it? You want mommy to be done? You want all the attention for yourself? Go by so fast. <laughs> why? Why must you grow? Why? Why must you grow? Can you stay my little baby forever? Ow! Ow! My nose. Six months flew by. It was, you know, it was hard in the beginning. This one was just, wah, wah. he wasn't sleeping. He was, she was up every hour. 45 minutes to an hour at night. I didn't, I don't know how I made it through because I was not sleeping. But we made it. We're here. We're in one piece, right? So it will pass. If the new, the new one stage will pass. Hang in there. Keep up with the sleep training. Do not co sleep with your baby. That's the way they will not sleep. I, even right now, if I'm like too tired and I'm feeding him and I fall asleep on the bed, he'll fall asleep with me and then he's up a couple hours later. As if he's in his crib, he sleeps for the night, the whole night. But if he's next to me, I don't know if it's something about them smelling the milk or they're smelling their mother, they wake up so often. And he wakes up like, <laughs> you know, trying to eat. So I'll put the boob in his mouth, fall asleep, and he'll do the same thing. He'll do the same thing. So. We don't sleep. I don't sleep with him on the bed. He's sleeping in his crib. I'll feed him for the night, get him down for the night, and he stays asleep for the night. So do not co sleep, you guys. If you see your baby wake up every so often, but you guys are sleeping together on the same bed, try to change that. Change that. You'll see. You'll get some sleep. You'll get some sleep. No co sleeping. We've been training since he was like, I think three months he got in his crib. But I don't know, I'm all over the place with this video, you guys. I just wanna say, come on here, give you mother's encouragement that um, the newborn stage will pass. Love on your baby, take care of yourself, and take care of baby. If you feel like you're mentally not able to take care of baby, get some help, you guys. They will help, they are people you can talk to, plenty of people. In the hospital, you talk to your pediatrician, they'll refer you to the right people if you don't know where to go. The time does fly, so try to enjoy it. If you're not enjoying it, fix that. Whatever's stopping you from enjoying your little baby, fix it. I had an end of video right here. 
you have any questions, any concerns, or any <laughs> any tips for me, let me know in the comment down below. And um, I'll see you on my next one, you guys. Thank you for coming. Made it this far. Appreciate you. I'm going to see you on my next one. Bye, guys. <laughs> Trying to wet us, my girl. No, no, no.